This is an ABC Action News Tracking the Tropics update. Sponsored by Collis Roofing, the trustworthy roofer of Tampa Bay. Hello everybody, this is your Wednesday morning tropical update. We are starting to track our low pressure that we've been watching over South Georgia and North Florida the last couple of days emerging down into the Gulf of Mexico. Still not a depression, not a tropical storm, but the Hurricane Center is starting to now track the low setter and we are starting to see Things may be starting to come together here to the west of Tampa Bay, a flare up of thunderstorms overnight. This could be the general area where low pressure will develop over the next 24 to 48 hours. No official tropical system yet. We just had a lot of uh, leadway with this one. That's why we've been talking about it the last two to three days. Here's the latest track on this by later on this afternoon. Should be seeing a broad area of low pressure. Uh, the Hurricane Center is scheduled or has scheduled a Hurricane Hunter aircraft to go down down into the system later today. If they find a closed setter, we could certainly see a tropical depression by later on tonight or more likely Thursday morning. I think it's during the day on Thursday that we'll really see this starting to uh, congeal into a more organized storm, maybe already a weak tropical storm. By Friday, the system is south of New Orleans. The latest computer models take it a little farther west. Now, that is a concern for a couple of reasons. Number one, it starts to uh, impact places like East Texas, big population center there around Houston and Beaumont. The other issue is, is the farther west it goes, the longer it stays over water, and that could mean a stronger system. The models here indicate maybe impacting southwestern Louisiana and southeast Texas on Saturday afternoon and Saturday evening. Then that's the system with its heavy rain moves into southern Arkansas. This would also be an issue as the farther west it goes. The terrain here gets more mountainous inland and flash flooding would be a big concern for the mid south Oklahoma, northeast Texas and western and southwest Arkansas. As far as the rest of the Gulf quiet here, the Caribbean also relatively quiet scattered showers and storms with strong upper level winds and the Atlantic also looking quiet so far. We've got updates on that tropical system anytime you want them on the weather page of abcactionnews.com. Storms are nothing new to us. We know the signs. We know how important it is to get a roof back over your head once the storm blows over. So when the signs of the storm are brewing, this is the only sign you'll need to remember. Collis Roofing.